So we are on day two of World Class Speaker Mastery and you know, research has shown that there's two factors that um, contribute to your success. Okay? The first one, and this is research, has shown that the better looking you are, or the better presented you are, or the better you look, the more promotion and success that you get. That's just, just, it's just been a proven fact. The second thing that accelerates your success is confidence and self-esteem. And did you know that you know, a lot of people who are very successful, they, they seem to have a lot of confidence, they seem to have a lot of self-esteem. And you know, we've had people fly here, they've, they've flown over, you know, some people, seven or 8,000 miles to be at this event. They've invested a large amount of time and also a large amount of uh, money and investment just to be at this event. And the question is why? The question is, if you had more success in your life or if you had more confidence in your life, and you had better self-esteem, um, do you think that would ripple to different parts of your life? Of course it would. The thing is you can't change one thing in your life without it affecting other parts of your life. And that's certainly what I found is, is becoming a speaker. People say, why, why do I need to become a speaker even if I don't want to become a public speaker? Well, it's because of confidence. It's because of self-esteem. Do you know your self-esteem is directly linked to the income that you earn? I mean, it really is. It's linked to uh, you know, how much money you make, it's linked to the, the type of relationships that you, you get involved in, it's, it's really linked to the, the, the state and the lifestyle that you live right now, it's, it's how confident you are, it's how much self-esteem you have, it's how much respect and what I call self-concept. Everyone has a self-worth. You know, if I was to say to you that, you know, think of how much money you earn right now and, and do the same job for half the price, would you do it? Probably not, why? Because you're worth more. So a big part of this is really understanding, first of all, who you are, what your message is, and really thinking about, you know, from a scale of one to 10, how, how big is your self-esteem right now? You know, again, people have traveled thousands of miles to be here. They have invested a lot to be here, not only in money, but also time. And the question is why? And I, I always say that, that for a, a lot of people who are creating success in their life, they make a commitment and they make a commitment to do something in their life. It's not just, oh yeah, I think I'm gonna do it, I might do that. They go, no, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do whatever it takes, and I'm gonna make that commitment because the universe will not give you the things you want unless you first commit, unless you first tell the universe you are ready. And th you know, that's why I wanna give this lesson is, is that the, the more um, confidence you have and the more self-esteem that you have, the higher the success that you'll achieve in life. And that's, that's, that's almost, if you think about it, th think about, the, the decisions that you make, it requires confidence. Think about the conversations that you could have had with other people that you didn't for whatever reason. Think about all the times that you should have done something but you didn't do it because you didn't have the courage. Well, it comes down to confidence. And the more confidence you have, the more self-esteem that you have, the more action you take, and the more money and success in life you'll get. And again, it's not just about money, it's about achieving the things that you want in life and having the courage and the confidence to do them. If you had 10 times more confidence than you had right now, do you think you'd be further on in life? I think you would, you know? So, you know, if you're watching this video and you think, actually, I could do with a bit of that, just, just practice, you know? Just, just go out there, start a conversation with someone who, who you know, go out of your comfort zone. The, the, the further you stretch out of your comfort zone, the more that you'll be able to achieve, and that's what I found. So, I hope you found this lesson useful. Uh, we're about to start day two of World Class Speaker Mastery here in beautiful Bali. It's about 32 degrees and I'm sweating wearing this t-shirt. Uh, you can't see my back right now. So um, I look forward to seeing you later. See you later.